What's up you guys, it's Isaac with the Chance here, here for my 19th video review. And today we're going to be looking at Transformers Studio Series Voyager Class Megatron. So for the package, um, you got the inside inside here, we already got the image of the inside the window of uh, Megatron. And then here's a post of Megatron, and he is number, and he is the number 13, and he is from Transformers Revenge of the Fallen. And here's the logo of the um, Transformers um, logo right here, where... And there's the Autobot symbol where it says Generations. And this is from Takara Tomy, I think. Um, and here's Megatron. He is a Voyager class figure. And this was made by Hasbro. And so here on the side, here's a post of Megatron here. And here is the other side of Megatron here. They could at least put a Decepticon symbol right here. And put the other ones on the Autobots, because, you know, this is an Autobot symbol. And here is Megatron in the back, him in his vehicle, in his robot mode, in vehicle mode, and he has 32 steps. And then, then and then right here, you already, and then you get the other figures, like you got, um, Brawl, Optimus Prime, and Starscream. Um, I am getting, I think next time I'm going to get, um, Brawl and Starscream. I, I already got Optimus. Which I didn't review back in May, which that's my fault. But I'm gonna review him anyway. Him and Ratchet. I'm not gonna review Bumblebee because his back piece falls off, which that's not fun. So is that it? And he is from the Forest Fight, which says here. Which it says here. And you got that cool image of the Decepticon symbol because he is from Revenge of the Fallen. This is his mode from the movie. I know this doesn't. Um, Oh well, forget the message. Back so, so on the package of this guy, that's about it. So let's get Megatron out and see how awesome he actually is. So here we have Megatron open up and out of the package, and he's also in his tank mode. Well, it's Cybertronian tank mode. Well, if you haven't, I, you know, if you've seen Revenge of the Fallen, um, this is the tank mode that he transformed into. Yeah. A little trouble with the transformation because his leg won't stay together because of these legs. Yeah, a little trouble there. That's my fault. Now, his cannon can like like this cannon can go up, but it, yeah, it's, sorry about all of that. This is all I can do for now with the transformation. But yeah, and then you. It, it, at least it got tank um, wheels like here that he had in the movie and he does look really cool in his um, um, Cybertronian tank mode but this is when um, Scowbull from Decep from um, Transformers um, Revenge of the Fallen um, gave him an upgrade and, and Megatron returned to life that's why Soundwave heard um um Galloway um, talk about Megatron when he was on tomorrow he was underneath the ocean after he was killed in the in the final battle in the first movie that was kind of a spoiler alert but I don't at least everybody saw Transformers yep like I said Megatron looks good and he does come with um yeah this is all I can do for now yeah, I know it's a little sloppy, but I'm I'm gonna get used to it. He does come with the uh, he does come with his menu. Like you do got instructions here, like in the back. No, this is the front, and this is the back. Oops. Let me get it folded up. Yeah, I don't really use the menus. Yeah, Megatron does have a menu. Yeah, and he does come with the, uh, yeah. Yeah, this thing will not come out. Hold on a minute. Okay, it's, it's out. So he does come with the same, probably like the same cardboard that Optimus Prime has. Um, this is, um, Megatron's. You can put him, um, him in the tank mode, like right here. Hold on a minute. Yeah, told you. 
He does come with at least he does come with the um the um the cardboard of the forest set where him and Optimus Prime where where him Optimus Prime Blackout and Starscream. Not not Blackout Grinder, thank you. Sorry. I'm thinking of Blackout, because Blackout's part of Studio Series as well. Um at least he at least they got the image of the forest. It's where they got into an Got to the forest fight in Revenge of the Fallen, which is the second Transformers movie that came out eight years ago in 2009. Yeah, I mean, it's the studio series, and the scene he is number 13. And is that and 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 then right in the nearest the, the, um, the logo where it says Transformers Revenge of the Fallen, then that's where Optimus got attacked by Starscream and Grinder and Megatron. At least I didn't say blackout this time. Blackout is from Stadia Series. But he does look like Grinder though. And I don't know why. Yeah, Megatron. This is all I can do. So, yep. This is all I can do for Megatron for now. I don't know why. Sorry it took me so long. Because I just had to get him transformed. Yeah. Like I always said. Like... Like, um, when you buy Transformers Studio Series figures, um, you're gonna have to get used to it. Cause I know they get a little frustrating and when you transform them to, um, um, vehicle modes. Yes, yeah, vehicle modes. That's all I'm gonna say. And, um, plane modes and helicopter modes or whatever. You're gonna have to get used to it. Huh. I know they get, I understand movie Transformers, like, I understand the movie Transformers I'm um, getting a little frustrating the transform the vehicle mode or robot mode. Well, not well, the robot mode's fine, but the vehicle mode, you get a little gets a little frustrating sometimes. But you're gonna have to get used to it. It takes practice, a lot of practice, practice and practice. Now I practice. I used to practice. I you know I practice transformer. I mean transforming transformers figures as a child. You know it's. Uh, and it took a lot of practice for me to do it. So anyway. So yeah, Megatron actually looks good. He does come with these cannon guns, whatever you call these things. I guess these are like can these canyons that he shoots out. And I guess he transformed the tank mode, probably in the one part when they were about to get into a forest fight. Decepticons I'm talking about. So that's about it for Megatron for now. So let's get down to transformation. It's kind of it's kind of easy, I think. So what you'll do is you will take this. Actually, no. Let's start with the legs, cause. So yeah, some reviewers I'm saying they start with they probably start with the legs. I don't know. But, so you do so what you'll do is you'll take these legs out. Make sure my hand doesn't get in the way this time. So let's start with the low let's start with the legs first. So it's quite simple. So what you'll do is um you take this, put and then you will push this back, and then you will, um, you will grab this piece here and flip it up just like that, and then what you'll do with this piece, you will bring it down just like that, and then, and then what you'll do with this heel, the heel. You'll bring it down just like that. I mean, I don't know what to do with this piece right now. Let me look at the box one more time. See what the. Oh, okay. Never mind. Yep. And this piece goes like just like that. And then you want to open these up. See, just like that. And then what you'll do is you will twist. Yeah, rot yeah, I was gonna say you wanna rotate the leg just like that. 
Yeah, just. Oh yeah, I was gonna say you wanna. And then you'll push this to this side. Hold on a minute. Oh, okay. Now I got it. Actually, it probably stays like this for now. Yeah, let's just leave it like this. Oh, yeah, it stays like that. So do the same. And wait. Here's the one part. This. You want to bring... You want to rotate the leg just like that. I want to put this piece up to the, like this piece to this piece like right here and it will tab in and then the leg is down so do the same on this side you have to, like twist the leg you want to take this yeah like take this piece and put it on this side take this put this piece up do it just like Hang on a second. Yep, just like that. And boom. Oh, wait. And put this piece down now. And then you know what you'll do with... So this piece goes down. And then you want to grab this piece. And just... Put it up just like that. <sighs> Hold on a second. And yeah, just open this up. All right. And then what you'll do is you grab this piece, you grab this, and you put it on this side too. Let me fix this. Wait, you want to take this down? I forgot. And then what you'll do here, you'll take this head. You'll take the head, bring it down, and don't push it back. Yeah, I'm actually, let's start off with the arms. So what you'll do is you'll take the arms out, just like that. Take this out too. And now you can take this, you can put the head down. And then the what you'll do is you'll put the cannon inside and then you'll put the whole, the full pieces inside the back here. And it gets easily. Boom! You want to flip that up? <laughs> I forgot. Now I'm going to do the rest of this. Yeah, like I said, I understand they get a little frustrating sometimes. take these pieces I, I know I can't push them down right now okay I got it I almost got it got it and then you'll do the same on this side 
Okay, I got it. Never mind. Then there you have it. So there you have Megatron in his robot mode. So, oh, wait. And now you have Megatron in his robot mode. So, he actually looks really nice. Well, yeah, he does look nice. Yeah, his, yeah, I know. The problem is, but the issue is, is this. This is the problem I have trouble with. Yeah, this little hole right here. Yeah, I could... You know, Hasbro could at least done better, like, just put, like, cover pieces on this side. They probably didn't do it. So, he actually looks amazing. This is much, you know, I think this is much better than the Revenge of the Fallen figure. At least, they, at least, they made this one, because this is a Voyager class figure anyway. So, what, you see this? So you'll take at least you'll take this out and this will become his um his blade that he stabbed Optimus Prime in the in the back with. Yeah, that's that's sad that Prime died in Revenge of the Fallen. But at least he came back to life though. Yeah, ask Sam Wibbergy, he brought him back to life. So Optimus no no, what's the name? Megatron, thank Megatron. So what? So his articulation here. So he can swivel his um head just like that, and he can look up and down like always. Yeah, I haven't had like I haven't had Megatron since eleven years ago. Well, I was a child during that time. I haven't had Megatron for a long time, and then at least so he can. Oh, hold on a minute. Yeah, his piece doesn't want to stay on. Sorry, Megatron, you're gonna have to keep your piece on. <laughs> so he can't bend his arms and put his arms up and down a little bit and then this and just the same thing, just like that. And he can um uh, yeah, these things are like staying open. Just leave it. So with the I heard reviewers I think I heard reviewers said these pieces fall off easily, so you gotta be very gentle. When you take them out of the package, like, I think they could at least put, I think Hasbro could at least put screws on these. Like, they could have. They probably didn't even know. You know how Hasbro is all the time, just not getting, you know, like, they did Bumblebee. Like, the Studio Series Bumblebee's, like, the Studio Series Bumblebee, his back piece falls off. Like, I can't take that no more. At least, yeah, because I heard reviewers were complaining about it. So, that's all I got to say. At least, Megatron never had these cannons before. Like, I don't think he had these in the movie in, in Revenge of the Fallen. I don't think he had them. I think he had them in his vehicle mode, but his robot mode, I don't think he had them. So, that's all. That's all. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, his toe pieces don't want to stay, just don't want to stay separate. Oh, well. I'll just leave it alone anyway. And I don't know if he had the... Oh, that's why I don't think he had these in the movie. I, oh, that's why I think he did and did not. For, I haven't watched my Transformers movies for a while now. Yeah, it's been a while since I've been watching my Transformers movies. So that's all I got to say to this video about Megatron. So be sure to... Wait. So the next Decepticon I'm going to do is Blocked. So that's all I gotta say to this video. Be sure to like, subscribe, follow me on Instagram, comment down below, and I'll see y'all on my next video review for Terracon Blocked.